Hello Pisces, welcome to my channel, welcome back to uh, my channel for some of you guys, hope you guys are doing well. So this is your general, your general love reading for August, uh, we're going to take a look and see who's showing up in your reading, see what they're thinking and feeling regarding yourself and of course and vice versa as well. Feel free to jump ahead to the start of the reading guys, it is time stamped. This section is really for those that just kind of prefer to see me shuffle on uh, camera. So just click in the description bar below. See where it says start reading, click on that and that will bring you to the uh, start of the reading. Like I said, this section is really for those that just kind of prefer to see me shuffle on camera. love them. Just going to take these in, clarify them off camera and I'll be back. So Pisces, let's start your reading and of course take whatever side resonates with you guys and picking up as uh, this being your side, the person that you're dealing with over here, but you could always flip switch whatever side just kind of resonates the most. All right, okay, so at the moment you're showing up as the Empress, so you're very nurturing um, at this time when it comes to this person. I feel like you're showing up, you've got that twice as well here um, in terms of just what's going on internally. So you're very much showing up and embracing that nurturing side of yourself when it comes to this person, but at the same time trying to remain strong because you do want to advance this, um, but there's just been some delays in being able to do that. This person is, you know, showing up as the six. So there is certain memories or thoughts, uh, past time thoughts, past time memories that they have been thinking about at the same time. And, and it's not to say that they're, they're being held there or they want to go back there. It's more about processing what happened in the past for them at the same time moving away from it or at least attempting to move away from it with that eight. Let me show you guys. That eight of uh, cups there. The eight of cups talks about leaving something, moving away from something, walking away from something ultimately towards that ninth cup, emotional happiness. So they're in the process of kind of just moving away from something that they had some form of emotional tie to. Doesn't have to be, this could be something in the past, even way in the past as well. And they just haven't dealt with those emotions up until the point of meeting you or thinking about getting serious with you. Holding that in though, they are holding that in, um, but there is this, yeah, action, actions on their mind with that page of, um, sorry, the Knight of Pentacles. Action, taking action, you know, keeping the wheels turning in, in terms of them just kind of doing the work ultimately. But like I said, they're not sharing that. There is this keeping things to their self or keeping certain thick parts of that that journey um, to their self. You're, you're kind of on the verge, for some of you, uh, could be for the most most majority of you guys, there is love that's already bubbling or have has already been formed when it comes to you and, and this person. You feel in this person, you've got the ace of cups there. So your focus, your, your um, intention really is to build something but it's like you're nurturing this person through their process um because and and you know i feel like a decision was definitely made i feel like in the past you was faced with some form of choice about whether you wanted to continue to proceed with this this person makes you happy but yeah of course there's recognition of not being able to move forward or feeling stuck there's a or a halt or non-movement some form of non non-movement as much as there was that foundation that was already being laid. But it's interesting though, because you've got that world card there, which talks about seeing the bigger picture, uh, being able to see things in a different way. You, you being privy to some form of knowledge that allows you to see things in a different way, which you know allows you to be more patient with this stuck type of energy that was happening in the past. At the same time, your person was going through just a difference in perspective about things. Like I said, I'm not sure. 
I'm not sure whether you've prompted or the situation with you has prompted this person to do the work um, or they've just not had an opportunity to realize that there's certain things that they still hold on from their past. Uh, but they're doing the work, you know, they see things differently. And there's this recognition or was this recognition of a change that needed to be made, but it's like, okay, and I want to do it quickly as well. I want to, I feel like maybe for, for a lot of them, they were somewhat surprised by them still having certain thoughts about relationships in general, uh, their past experience, which ultimately is having an effect on, on this, on this. And it's like, okay, I want to move out of that quickly. Having a lack of clarity around maybe how quick that's going to turn out or what's expected or what, how this is going to proceed forward. Not even so much the relationship, but more about them going through the process of releasing this stagnant energy that they could have been holding on to for um, a while. Um, yeah, we've got the moon card again, this lack of, lack of clarity, but there is that two, the two of cups there, Pisces and that page. Two of cups speaks about emotional connection, and the page of one talks about being drawn towards something, being pulled towards something, which is you, you know, recognizing that this could be, and I don't want to use the word, I want to be careful how I explain this. Seeing this as a solution, it's like, uh, hopefully that's enough, but it, it might not be for some of you. So I want to try and explain this a little bit better. It's like this recognition of meeting you or being in this relationship with you that it's the solution to them moving out of this stagnant energy that they maybe didn't even realize that they was in. Yeah. Yeah. Um, like I said, they are still holding things back or holding things in, not sharing. Um, there is a lot of chemistry with the lover's card there. There's attraction between you both. Could be very different as well in some way, shape or form. Realizing that, Yes, I've I've put work in, or you know, there's been steps. There's steps that've been made for us to develop or progress this relationship, but it's not been enough. Um, but also recognizing that there's some form of element. How do I put that? Rewind. Recognizing that. Acknowledging, we'll say that. Acknowledging that you bring some form of positive aspect into their life, even if it's like I said to support this person in recognizing that they're still in this funk and they need to move through that in order for them to have a blossoming relationship. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. So the, 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 the challenge really is, is, is how long is this person going to take to move through this, really? I mean, you have the patience for now. And I feel like that's not going to, you know, you're not going to, I feel like that you're, you're, you're adamant in being able to support this person because you're thinking about the bigger picture. There's an awareness for you about long term or long run or having some form of bigger picture. So I don't feel like you're going to duck out just yet. It's more about how long it takes this person to, you know, move through this process um, and how and, 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 you know, I'm just looking at that holding back, keeping things in. Yeah, I don't think it's, you know detrimental to the relationship i feel like maybe they just want to keep certain things to themselves when it comes to, to to this the really the challenge really is is how long is this going to going to take for this person to actually move through this and are and is there going to be any challenges coming up for them which ultimately has an effect on you both so we're going to move into the uh, extended version now so link is in the description bar below guys and i'll just see you guys in a bit Ooh.